Hi YouTube friends! Welcome! Welcome to Abby's Creative Hands at Crochet! I am super excited to share with you what's going on this weekend in my life. Well, today is Friday and it's about 4.30 in the afternoon here in the South Florida area and here it's beautiful even though it's raining. It's thundering and lightning, but I think rainy days are just as beautiful as any other day. And the best thing for me to do by now is to get my drink. Look, I bought this today at the dollar store. Look how pretty. See? It says, joy, prayers, blessings, faith, love, wor worship. It's family time. Jesus, it's so pretty, and it was only two dollars. And even if it falls, nothing is gonna happen because it has a good cover. Oh, I thought that I had left the price there. Well, let me tell you what's going on. Like I said, today it's Friday, and to some people, it's happy hour. To me, it's just Friday. And I have plans for tonight. I have a friend, she's a school teacher, and we've known each other for 15 years. And today's her last day of work at, in the school system. So we are going to celebrate and we're going to go out to have dinner and have a girl time. We love spending time together. And um, I went to the Dollar Tree about a week and a half ago and I bought these. I probably tried one of them tonight. I don't know which one, but this one is glamorous and this one is traditional. So you know what? I think today I'm gonna try glamorous. Why glamorous? Because that's how I feel today. Glamorous. Um I wanted to share with you that I'm working on a project. And it's a vest. I'm going to do a vest using the Granny Square project. And I'm probably going to be needing a big uh, Granny Square to fit my back. And then other Granny Square in smaller portions to cover my front. And then after that, I'm going to get real pretty buttons and maybe... Um, get uh, some pretty beads or maybe another color that would match this pretty yarn. As you can see, I already started it. I am super excited. I'm using hook size K, which is a 6.50 millimeter, and I'm using this type of yarn. This is 744, um, uh, 744 yards. And it's the color, you can see it. I'm going to put it like that so maybe you can see it there. That's a good thing, okay. And this is a huge skein of yarn. And I'm going to keep, I'm going to be working on this um, maybe tonight when I get back. And tomorrow, tomorrow I'm going to be going to a park. I love going to the park where there is a lake, where there is a lot of children playing around and their families. And I'm going to take my Jimmy Gordon, uh, Jimmy Johnson um, chair, my books, my lunch bag, my little cup, my little radio, and I'm just going to have a relaxing time. Why relaxing time? Because I've had a rough week this past week. Really rough. I had a family emergency and it was, I mean, so scary. It was scary. But thank God everything is back to normal and my mom is okay. My mom had a fall and she hit her forehead and um, she's up in age and you know, I don't know if you have a family member of 
know someone who suffer from Alzheimer's or dementia or short-term memory. That is so sad. And my mom suffers from dementia. And there's times when, you know, there's times when she doesn't know who I am. And there's times where I have to, you know, do everything for her. And when I saw my mom on the floor, you know, crying, it broke my heart. Immediately, I took her to the emergency room, and from there, I was transferred with her. She was transferred to another hospital uh, via ambulance because she needed stat CT scans of her, her head, of her brain. And she was scared to death, and I was too. I was just trying to be more calm and collected. But she would see my tears. And she would say, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, Mama, don't worry, you're going to be fine. So, you know, she's home already and she is much better. But um, I know some of you believe in the Lord. I just keep, I pray that she gets better. And I hope you, my YouTube friends, those who have. You know, my same belief or belief in our Lord Jesus Christ. Keep my mom in prayer because she needs all the little prayers they could get right now. And going back to a much prettier conversation, um, I saw my granddaughter, uh, my grandbaby yesterday, and she's gone back home already. And she's going to be a year old um, this coming it's coming Monday, and I had a wonderful time with her yesterday, and she's beginning to take her little steps already, and she's just, she's just adorable. She's a blessing in my life, but I just wanted to share that with you, and I thank you. I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for you, for you coming to visit my channel. And spend a little time with me. You know, sometimes we need we need to talk and we need to have friends. And I consider each and every one of you, my 74, 76 YouTube subscribers, I see you as friends. Not as a YouTube, someone that comes along and listens to me. No, I consider you all friends. And we, when you have friends, you treasure them you like spending time with them and I wish you all a wonderful wonderful and safe weekend and I hope you do something beautiful because I know each and every one of you have a beautiful talent and I know each and every one of you have done beautiful things so if you like you could find me on Facebook uh, hooks and loops equals screech, um, sorry, hooks and loops equals crocheting. That is my small group in Facebook. And show me your projects. I'm going to put the link below so you could come and visit my small group in Facebook. Until then, God bless you all. Have a wonderful weekend and be safe.